Welcome back. More than 29 million people in the U.S. live with diabetes. But now they have a new way to monitor their glucose. It was just approved by the Food and Drug Administration. News for Utah's Saray Chen explains how this long-term system works. It's called the EverSense Continuous Glucose Monitoring with an implantable glucose sensor that can last up to three months. For people with type 1, it's a rare individual who would not benefit greatly from continuous glucose monitoring. And I think in the year 2018 and beyond, it is the standard of care. So this current system is another step along that path to less painful, less invasive, less intrusive technology that allows people to have to know their glucose levels and act on them. The EverSense Continuous Glucose Monitoring, or CGM, features an implantable glucose sensor and provides long-term continuous monitoring for up to three months. Made things more pleasurable for my life and just doing what I was doing. Um, I think it's, it's awesome. Made you more aware of wh what times of day you tend to go high or low. Uh, that was very positive. Doctors and patients say it's an easy process, taking a few minutes for each doctor's visit. You have a very small sensor that in a few minutes is put in, in the office under the skin and it heals up. Then you put over it a transmitter. The information is then sent to your cell phone. If you're away from your phone, the sensor can give body alerts, a vibration telling you when your sugar is high or low. Having the comfort of the alert and alarm system going 24-7 just allows you to go through life with less stress and less uh, worries about having hypoglycemia. Doctors say patients with diabetes can greatly benefit from continuous glucose monitoring, but often not used. They say it's just one more thing to consider. In the newsroom, Saray Chin, News 4, Utah. The Eversense CGM is for patients 18 or older. It's intended to complement, not replace, those finger stick blood glucose monitoring.